hello gemini's welcome back to the channel it's a scene tarot and today we're going to do your love reading to see what's going on with you and your person gemini if you guys are new here remember to like the video if the video do resonate with you by liking the video youtube sees that you like it youtube sees that it resonates and push the videos forward into a bigger audience so the video can grow so the channel can grow okay um and i always say that in every one of my videos y'all because i have to um, and if it doesn't resonate, you guys, I'll have a link down below in the description. It will be your playlist. All right. Okay, guys, let's see here. What's going on with you and your person, Gemini? Gemini, please. What's going on with Gemini's today? What's going on with Gemini's today? Person, angels. Hope you guys are doing well. Oh my goodness. Life is beautiful. No matter what you're going through, remember that. Keep a positive energy. Let the energy flow. hangman here okay we have the high the high fraud <laughs> and then we have the eight of pentacles all right so you guys um i feel like there is a a person that's actually waiting in the wings to confront this issue whatever you guys are go have going on i don't feel like this person is, is in contact with you at this present time i feel like this person is waiting in the wings to see when things die down to talk to you however i do see someone that is not really sure about what to do in this situation because the high front is in reverse i also feel like there is someone or some other people might be involved in this person's ears talking to them telling them what they should do what they shouldn't do and this person is confused this person is not in their powered self at this present time where the high fraud is like i don't take advice for anybody nice for you to tell me that but i'm gonna make a decision for myself no matter what but at this present time this person is just very confused not entwined with themselves and they're listening to everybody and their mama about what to do about the situation okay then we have the eight of pentacles okay so somebody's thinking that this relationship is a loss right now okay like there's no hope for this but yet somebody's waiting <laughs> in the winds to talk to somebody or to wait for see which time they could come in and just tell you how they feel the judgment is in reverse this person needs to be careful whoever is hurting who here they need to be very careful because the angels are involved here mm -hmm. wow so we have the judgment a decision needs to be made and it haven't been made yet. This is because your person haven't made it yet as well. And the angels are watching your person to see what decision they made. And this is a person actually that did wrong. So the angels are watching this person, whoever did wrong to someone or wronged someone in this situation. Okay. When they make the right decision, they won't have their karma. Angels will you know, reward you and your person. But if they make the wrong decision, then a decision will be made on the angel's part. Okay. We have the four of cups here which i feel like you are just over this connection you're bored with this person but this person is coming in as a friend okay acting like they don't really want to be with you but they do hmm. the five of cups is also here that's telling me that you didn't get what you want from this person you know this person was just oh lord this cards were falling you guys this person made you feel like you wasn't worth it in this relationship with this five of cups here they make you feel abandoned okay but this is something you have to deal with because if this person could make you feel like that there are some issues here that you need to look into within yourself okay but i feel like this person made you feel or you always felt this way like okay every time i try to build a relationship with someone this is what happens 
this is what happens. It doesn't work out, you know? Like you wait for the ball to drop or the wheels to fall off of this relationship. All right, or any relationship. But then we have the eight of wands here. Like someone is rushing back towards you because they do love you. But you know, they're not happy with the situation right now. They're not happy with how things fell apart. They're not happy with their situation, how their, their life is right now. I feel like this person is willing to still fight for you, but there is a burnt out situation here. Like somebody feels very burnt out. Like, why am I dealing with the same situation? This is what I'm getting. Why am I dealing with this again? But I, I'm trying to walk away, but I can't. Because I love this person. Damn, I love this person. This is what I'm getting. <laughs> Like, they're fighting with themselves. The Queen of Wands here. Somebody likes being around you. <laughs> yeah, they're going to come towards you, honey. Get ready. <laughs> uh, but the confidence is shot. All right. Well, this person loves being around you in the Queen of Wands. They feel like you could make them better. Like... When they were with you, you bring them out of their comfort, their, their comfort zone, um, you know, and they're going to communicate this with you. They're gathering up their confidence to come towards you, but I feel like when this person is towards you, um, they might be a little bit unconfident with themselves, you know? I feel like they won't offer you, like, a second chance, but they're trying to talk to you. I feel like this person just want to be around you. And you might say, why the hell are you around me the way this person come off? I've just got that. Like, but here is the justice because this person chose you. You have the ace of pentacles and then you have the six of pentacles in reverse. Wow. So this person chose you, okay? Chose you to be with. They want to build a life with you, a legacy with you. But there is this thing where this person tends to spend a lot for some of you. Or this person tends to not give back in this relationship or get too comfortable in this relationship and not keep the passion going in this relationship. And I feel like you tend to be bored because the Four of Cups is here. Like, this is a main issue where you feel like you're bored. And that's why you feel like the Five of Cups, like... You feel like this person abandoned you a lot because they don't put back in this relationship. They don't spend time with you. They don't do things that's important when it comes to the relationship. Ugh. But they're rushing towards you because they hurt you. Okay, Somebody hurt somebody here. We have the Three of Swords here. For me, the Three of Swords talk about three people, three broken hearts, three people trying to get over this. A third party connection might be coming in for some of you since it's a general I mean, these people are hurt right now. They're not over this situation. We do have the Five of Swords here in the upright and then the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. So somebody is very much single, lost a lot of money, not doing very well for, for the, in the single life at this present time. And then in the Five of Swords, you know, I feel like a lot of betrayal lies in deceit, embarrassment. Look at this person, like, Really? I mean, this person is like, you may, like, you stole from me for some of you. Like, your person probably stole from you. Oh, my God. Let's see what's on the back. You have the Ace of Pentacles. I mean, the Ace of Wands. You know, Swords. I'm sorry. Is that Swords? Yeah, Ace of Swords in reverse. Then you have the King of Wands in the reverse. Then you have the Ten of Swords in the reverse. Then you have the Ace of Wands in the upright, which is very interesting. So, oh, Lord. Lord, this person is going to come towards you even though they feel like you might reject them. Like, they, they think that it's over. But they're coming towards you anyway. And, you know, I feel like you are at a place where you're going to be healed by when this person, you're like, you're ready to forgive this person and move forward. I don't know if you're going to move forward with this person or not. And then the Ace of Wands, I feel like this person wants a new beginning. It's up to you if you want that. But I feel like it's not a closed situation because it's in the upright. Oh, wow. But all right, Gemini, this is what I see for you. I hope it resonates. If it resonates, you know what to do. Like this video. Give this video a big thumbs up here on YouTube. And I'll see you guys in your next one. Bye, guys.